Now we are going to see triangle. First we must know what is triangle because after that we are going to see perimeter triangle and area of the triangle and after that the entire chapter will be over. First what is a triangle we must know about it. What is a triangle? See a triangle is a simple closed geometrical figure bounded by three line segments. See this is the or triangle shape. See this is one, this is x and this is y and z. See this is a, what is this? A triangle is a simple closed geometrical. It's a closed figure. It's a closed figure bounded by three line segment. See this is x and this is y and this is z. See x, y is one line segment and y, z is a second line segment and x, z is a third line segment. It's a completely closed figure. It's a completely closed figure, closed geometrical figure. So a triangle is a simple and closed geometrical figure bounded by three line segment. Again, I'll repeat what is a triangle? What is a triangle? So what is a triangle? A triangle is a simple closed geometrical figure, simple closed geometrical figure bounded by three line segment simple closed geometrical figure bounded by three line segments this is the what answer for the question what is a triangle so x y and y z and what x z or z x whatever you can say this this is called as a line segment that is what i written on the top x y and after that I have written the line segment symbol x y is a line segment y is it a line segment and x is it also a line segment and three sided polygon it's a three sided what is the properties of triangle three sided polygon the x y x y is a line segment and y is a line segment and x is it is a line segment or else x y is it this is x y and is it a sides okay and three vertex vertices vertices means it's nothing but See first what is a polygon? A closed plane figure bounded by a straight line. A closed plane figure is a what? It's a closed figure. A closed plane figure. Plane means a, a normal surface. Okay. A closed plane figure bounded by straight line. Bounded means it's built by a straight line. So this is a straight line. Again the straight line. This is also, how many straight lines are there? Three straight lines. So it's a polygon. It's a closed plane figure. It's a closed plane figure. Closed plane figure bounded by straight line even you can write is it not is it you can write yes closed plane figure bounded by a straight it is a polygon so a three sided polygons one side two side and three side polygon so that is what x y line segment y is it a line segment and x it x z is a line segment that is what i did on the top i just draw the line or else x y z we can say that and three vertices x y z how many vertices three vertices that is called as, um, it is defined as the highest point or the point where the two lines are intersect. See, look at this line. This is x and this is y and this is z. So, this line is joined together. So, and this line is also joined together. So, this is joined, you are also joined. So, this two lines joined together. So, this is one point. Again, this, this line and this line joined together okay two and again this line and this line is also joined together so one here these two lines are joined together so that's the point is here one and these two lines are joined together this is two so the point is here and these two points are joined together this is three so what this is the point so here one point here one point here all together three points so from this point to this point one line and from this point to this point two and this point is this 3. So it is defined as the highest point or the point where two lines intersect. Two lines. One, this is one line and this is two line. So this is an intersection point. And this is one line and this is another line. So two lines are intersect. See one line, again two line, again three line. So two lines are intersect. It is otherwise we can call it as a highest point. So highest points. See here one here one see one line two line so this is the intersection point again this again one line and this two line so this is the intersection point and this line again this line so this is the intersection point so that is what the vertices so what I is called, we have to give the name, this is the highest point, this is the highest point, this is the highest. So x, 
Why and is it a vertices? Okay, so how we are going to call, how we are going to read or write means uh, what is triangle X, Y, Z. So if the angle is here, we can call it as angles are here. So X, Y, Z, one angle. So otherwise, we can call it as Y, Z, X is another angle. Otherwise, we can call it a X, Z, Y. So another angle. Otherwise, Z, X, Y. See? x y z one angle and y z x is a another angle the next is z x y is a third angle so this is the diagram x and y and z small x we can represent in small x y z okay so angle means this is x y z and y z x and third one is z x y so in the middle we can consider as a angle the middle place that is x y angle x y z in the middle letter is an angle the next angle uh, y z x the middle letter it is an angle next angle l z x y this x is a angle okay